Mark Fleischman, who owned legendary New York nightclub Studio 54 in the 1980s, has died by assisted suicide in Switzerland, his former business partner has said. Mr. Fleischman, 82, took over the club in 1980 and ran it until 1986. He first became ill in 2016 and was left unable to walk or do many things for himself, but said doctors had not been able to diagnose his condition. He took his life at the Dignitas Clinic near Zurich on Wednesday. Daniel Fitzgerald, who co-owned the Century Club in Los Angeles with Mr. Fleischman in the 1990s and 2000s, told BBC News, I guess he was in more pain than he knew. Mark Fleischman, who owned legendary New York nightclub Studio 54 in the 1980s, has died by assisted suicide in Switzerland, his former business partner has said. Mr. Fleischman, 82, took over the club in 1980 and ran it until 1986. He first became ill in 2016 and was left unable to walk or do many things for himself, but said doctors had not been able to diagnose his condition. He took his life at the Dignitas Clinic near Zurich on Wednesday. Daniel Fitzgerald, who co-owned the Century Club in Los Angeles with Mr. Fleischman in the 1990s and 2000s, told BBC News, I guess he was in more pain than we knew. Every night, celebrities and stunning women made their way through the crowd, up the stairs to my office to sip champagne and share lines of cocaine using my golden straw or rolled up $100 bills. He added, I was the guy in control, the owner, the host of the party. It was my duty, my job, to make sure everyone had a good time. It was a responsibility, a heady feeling, one that I gave myself over to wholeheartedly. It was an exclusive world where anything could happen. Mr. Fitzgerald added that, while they ran the Century Club, he and Mr. Fleischman worked really well together for a long time and had a lot of fun together. He would be able to have fun, but be really smart at the same time and be really intelligent about figuring things out. He taught me a lot. He was a great mentor for me.